All right, hello everyone. Uh, this is an update to our shooting projectiles. This time we're gonna be able to shoot in four directions. All right. So right now this game is set up only to shoot in one direction. So when I shoot, it only goes one direction. But what if you go up, you want to shoot up, left, right. Um, we could even add eight directions. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to add some shoot directions here. So we're going to be able to shoot to the right, to the left, down, and up. Then if you really want to take this even further, you could even shoot on the diagonals if you really wanted to. Okay? But I will show you the basics for the four directions, and if you want to add the other directions, you can. All right. Uh, so let's clear those out here, minimize this. Okay. So... Uh, what we're going to do is, uh, let me actually close this here. All right, go back to here. Okay, so first we're going to set up these directions. So on A button press, we already have that shoot. We need to add another button press, okay? When we push the right button, we want the computer to remember, the program to remember that the right direction has been set. So we're going to create a new variable, make a variable, and we're going to call this shoot direction. And when we start the game, we will set shoot direction to one, and that would be to the right there. I'll show you how to do that. Um, but what we're going to do is on right button pressed, we're going to set the shoot direction to one. Okay, so we'll start as one. Anytime they push the right, it will go to, to, the, to the one. Okay, uh, we're going to duplicate this, and when we push the left button, um, we're going to call the opposite, we're going to call the left side two. Okay, and uh, what you can see as I'm doing here is this direction will be one, this direction will be two, this direction, uh, let's just do three, and then this direction will be four. Um, it doesn't really matter what numbers you use, you can use 800 or five, but as long as you know what numbers you're using, right? When I push one, that's right down that's four whatever you want to translate this into you can so if this doesn't make sense to you and you want this to be two make that a two but just know when you push down that is two and not that two okay so we have one two three and four okay all right so let's duplicate these more when i press up okay i want that to be three duplicate this again and when i press down I want that to be four, okay? So now, on A button pressed, this is shooting to the right, we need to do some logic here, okay? If, okay, if true, so we need to do if, and we've got this comparison here. If, go to variables, shoot direction. If the shoot direction equals one, I want you to shoot to the right, okay? So we can test this right now. I push this shoot direction is one okay if i go to the left i've set the shoot direction to two and it should not shoot and it does not good it does work so far all right uh i'm gonna move these out of the way i'm gonna add some more okay we need four um for this to work i'm actually just gonna duplicate this and pull them all in here Okay, duplicate, duplicate, all right. So this will be shoot direction two, shoot direction three, shoot direction four, okay? So when I press left, that makes the projectile go to the left. So I'm gonna duplicate this, okay? And to shoot to the left, that's gonna be a negative 100, okay? And let's test this out. Go to the right, shoots, go to the left, shoots, beautiful, okay? Shoot direction three, that is going up, I believe. Let's see here, it's this one, right? Yep, shoot direction up. Okay, so this is going to be zero, and I believe negative 100. Let's see if this works. All right, I'm gonna push up. It shoots up, beautiful. And then you guessed it, for shoot direction four, this is gonna be positive 100, okay? Beautiful, so now I have these directions. I go right, I shoot, go left, I shoot, up, I shoot, down, I shoot, okay? If you 